How's it going guys? Nick from Inceta Boatworks here and we are on the first of our second generation 35 IFCs. Wanted to give you guys a quick walkthrough, show you some of the differences between this boat and our previous boats. Uh, so starting back here, you might be able to tell that we've now got the live wells integrated into the transom. What's great about that is it's increased our cockpit space by a little bit and it's massively increased our live well capacity. So we've got these dual transom wells awesome addition to the boat. You'll also notice that back here we've also integrated our transom rod holders instead of having the rocket launcher. And on this particular boat we've got plenty of storage for spear guns as well which is a pretty cool addition. You got the walkthrough transom with the acrylic insert right here so when you're fishing or diving pull that out. This is all usable space. When you're running, gunning, cruising around with the wife and kids you can put that back in make sure no one flies out. Moving back our entire liner is a, a new mold that we've redesigned. Uh, the hatches are significantly more sturdy, all on hydraulics. And as you can see, that bilge is super clean. We've got best marine pumps driving the live wells, and we've got two transducers, one high, one low frequency, because this boat is gonna do it all when it comes to fishing deep dropping, offshore, mahi, Bahamas, diving, the whole thing. Uh, just like our other boats, we've got insulated storage here. And we've got a rigging station with tackle storage here as well. And under the gunnels, you'll notice we've got spear gun holders. And you may not be able to tell, but we've actually widened the gunnels by two inches. Uh, allowing us to accommodate all different types, including these Gemlux rod holders, uh, which are absolutely gorgeous. At the helm, we've got three wide seats. We've got these custom wrapped uh, additions all over the boat. Really cool customization. And then we've got dual 19 inch Simrads here. The Simrad here to show all of your engines data. JL audio sound system. We've got a massive amount of tackle storage here on both sides and on the opposite side we've actually got trash cans. We use this for document storage and right next to it you've got where you can stow your fire extinguisher. And under the gunnels you'll also notice a new addition it's integrated hose holders. Now we can keep the hose off the deck and keep everything nice and clean and clear. And inside the console, one of our customers' favorite things is you have unrestricted access to all of your electronics in here. It's all temperature regulated and ventilated, so nothing overheats. And easy to maintain and work on. Moving forward, we've got our large insulated fish boxes. Pretty big. You could fit a full-size human in there. And it is the same on the other side as well. So you've got tons of insulated storage up here. This is non-insulated dry storage. And you also have easy access to your macerator pumps for your in-deck insulated fish boxes. Here we've got our lounger slash coffin box. You can use it for storage. You can use it for loading it up with fish. It's totally up to you. On this particular boat, we've got a stowed away table. That's for the cockpit, or shit, not the cockpit. We've got a stowaway table. <laughs> got yeah. And moving forward, we've also got another insulated box here for food, drinks, fish, whatever you'd like. And finally, up at the bow, we've got our easy anchor puller, Patriot windlass. Super simple, super easy to use, hasn't failed us. So uh, very simple and it works. Like I said, this is the first of our second generation boats. We're extremely proud of this build. Uh, it's going to a great family. Uh, Mr. Robert Arrington, AKA Deer Meat for Dinner, is gonna be taking this boat all over the east coast of the United States fishing from South Florida all the way up to Maine. So we're extremely excited about that. And uh, if you guys are interested, we'll be displaying this boat at the Miami Boat Show. So stop on by the Suzuki uh, Oasis at the Venetian Isle Marina 
and come check it out in person and go for a ride. Thank you.